Hello, Cancer. So twin flame readings won out in the little contest that I did last night in my community section. So this is going to be a twin flame, re twin flame reading. Wow. Um, you do not have to identify as twin flames, soulmates, relationship, whatever. Just whomever you're thinking of when you watch this video. Okay. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment. If you would like to be eligible for a, uh, to be entered into a drawing for a free weekly reading, I give away one every week. Um, to be eligible for that, you're going to want to like, share, subscribe, and comment in the comment section down below. Hashtag twin flame. Okay. I am also still doing personal readings and everything you need to know is in the description box below. All right. So once again, cancer, my cancer, cancer friend, uh, can't be everybody's reading. Okay. Take it as it resonates. Check your other placements, sun, moon, rising, and Venus. My Venus is in cancer. Um, Venus is how we present in relationships. Okay. So a lot of times, it, you know, if one sign didn't resonate for you, you know, and it's a relationship reading you're looking for, check that cancer placement. There is a link to uh, Cafe Astrology in the description box below. And it's a free website. You just plug in your birth chart information, your birth information, and it'll give you a free birth chart. Easy peasy. All right. So cancer. Roles can be reversed. There is no gender in tarot. I'm going to put you on one side, your person on the other. Flip it around if you need to. A lot of times we will get a mix of both people's energy on both sides. Let's do it. Bottom of the deck. Three of swords. Don't panic. All right. We've got death and the emperor. We've got the magician and the king of pentacles. We've got the page of wands and the eight of cups. We have strength in the world. We have the page of cups and the two of wands. We have the hermit and the six of cups. All right. So we have Scorpio, Aries, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Leo, Virgo, just the energy of the cards, though. I just call out the signs associated with them for whatever reason. With this three of swords on the bottom of the deck, okay? I'm going to tell you right now, um, I think this emperor and the king of pentacles are the same person. They don't have to be. That's just my first initial thought. Um, could be you, could be your person. All right, let's just see where this goes. Okay, we've got death. So some kind of transformation, something ending, something beginning. Okay. What is this death for my cancer friends? The five of cups. Sadness. There was a loss here. Um, even maybe, maybe sad about a breakup, but still moving forward, transitioning into some new energy here. What are we transitioning into? Okay. This is a tower moment. So whatever is ending, whatever breakup has happened, um, it's like the universe shook it up and, and kind of forced it to happen. Okay. Cause it, ne it needed to happen. Um, what is this emperor? What or who is this emperor? Well, it's you. King of Cups, Cancer, it's you. So this could be your breakup. It could be your person's breakup. I'm just saying that right now you're in this emperor energy. I feel like you've made room, you've made space, maybe even physical space, but certainly mental space. Um, you may have pulled your energy back from this person. Um, and that's what kind of prompted this tower moment. Give me one more for this King of Cups and this emperor. The Four of Pentacles. Um, and it's like now it's a waiting game. Okay. The magician. What is the magician? The six of swords. So somebody is manifesting a, 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 a transition moving on. Queen of pentacles. I'm getting a couple of different things here. I want to I want to pull some more cards and see how it plays out and then I'm going to go through it, okay?
four of wands for this king of pentacles. Okay. Here's what I see is happening. Cancer. This emperor, king of pentacles is your person. They have been with a queen of pentacles. There has been a tower moment. Okay. The reason there has been a tower moment is because this emperor has been stuck on you for a long time. Cancer. Stuck on you for a long time with that four of pentacles, king of cups. Okay. You are attached to this emperor energetically. They have been with this queen of wands, but they have manifested some kind of transition. The problem is they weren't really acting on it. So the universe came in and made something happen and it broke them up. Okay. Now, this emperor is the same person as this as this king of pentacles. And right on the top of this king of pentacles, we've got the four of wands. So certainly a twin flame situation, especially with this six of, of cups over here and the lovers. So now all of this energy, because the, this couple has broken up, now this energy of, of, um, of you is coming through to your person. Okay. So page of wands, I feel like this is, I feel like this is your person. This is your king of pentacles coming in to tell you that he walked away. Nine of pentacles. Yeah. He's single now because he walked away from that relationship. We've got the eight of cups right next to it. Seven of cups. And he's dreaming of you. He wants to be with you. May not know how to get there, but he's coming. This eight of cups. He walked away from an eight of cups, right? There's something missing missing there anyway. So he's in search of those two cups. Yeah, he's he's on a journey to he's he's got some other things maybe to clear up that are in his path and his way or some things he needs to figure out. But in the end, ultimately cancer, it's going to lead to a reconciliation with you. Yeah, the eight of cups. He thought long and hard about walking away from this from this queen of pentacles. He didn't really do anything about it. So the universe came in and just pulled the rug out from underneath him. Underneath both of them. It wasn't just because he wanted it to. They, you know, they were together to learn a lesson that, you know, they expended their time together and, and neither one wanted to let go for whatever reason. Here we have the strength card. Card of Leo. Doesn't have to be a Leo. Strength card. I get the feeling that this this King of Pentacles, that this is such a strong connection that he would cross the world to come to you, Cancer. Realizing where he's been and how long he's been gone um, and how big this is growing within him now and also realizing how big it must have been for you this whole time. Yeah, this the Strength card and the Seven of Wands. Um, he may feel um, like you're in like this protective mode that you've kind of drawn this line in the sand because it's been so long since you heard from him and he's going to have to really, really uh, work hard to, to get you to let him in. Yeah, Page of swords. He's been watching you. You may have been watching him also, but he's been watching you. And with this world card, he's, he's coming to tell you that he's closed out a cycle and, and ultimately wants to start a new one with you. But I also think that this is him traveling yeah, the fool. I just, even if he didn't like physically, geographically travel, he's made a lot of distance. He's, he's come a long ways. Um, and he wants, you know, he wants like, he wants a, a brand new beginning. He wants to start all over. Nine of wands. Yeah. He's carried that fire in his belly for you for a long time. He's carried that torch for a long time. Page of Cups. Could be you, could be him. What is this Page of Cups? Page of Cups, Two of Wands. We've got the Two of Wands here. I think you guys are on the same page. I just don't think you're going to say it outright. Not at the beginning, anyway. Um, I think you both really love each other and have been in love with each other for a while now. I also think um, this whole situation has been a lot to go through and nobody's ready to really just lay it on the table just yet. Five of pentacles, you know, cancer, you could be worried about rejection from this person. 
But this person is on the same page. They're ready to offer you the world. The Knight of Swords. And when they come in, it's going to it's gonna gain speed quickly. Once this person kind of crosses over into your energy, it's going to be fast moving. So here we have this hermit and strength. Yeah, it's like the strength of this connection put him on a path directly to you. Him or her, doesn't matter. Put this person on a path directly to, to you. Yeah, and the world starting a new cycle with you. And then here we have this, this six of cups, this ultimate, you know, this reconciliation. You've been on each other's mind the whole time. It's just whatever was going on over here had to play out. King of swords. Yeah. So now he's going from this knight of swords energy to this king of swords energy. I realize, okay, that he's a king of pentacles, but I'm telling you, um, when he comes through as the emperor, and he will be, um, he's got coming in to win. Okay. This King of Swords comes, comes to win. And the Page of Cups, he's going to be, he's going to have a lot of very sweet things to say to you with judgment on the bottom of the deck, reconciliation card, right? He's going to come in and, and say a lot of really sweet things to you. He's going to open up his heart, right? He's been heartbroken missing you. He realizes you've been heartbroken too, but you know, the relationship that he was in has left him single. He is single now. Okay. And he has made a choice that he wants something balanced and fair and equal. And he's chasing it. He's coming right after you. There's a lot of passion. Um, and you're matching his energy, telling the truth. Um, there's no games, right? There were some, maybe some secrets that were hidden in the past that really hurt your feelings, his feelings. But, you know, you, you guys could have even not spoken for a long time. But this person is going to break down those walls, right? They're coming in. They want everything with you. All right, Cancer. That's what I got for you. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and also comment hashtag twin flame in the comment section below. And I'm sending you tons of love and light. Until next time.